Melek'le onun için birazcık Melek'le biz 3 sene önce 3 sene oldu mu Melek? 3 sene, sene oldu evet. Biz TED'de tanıştık böyle bir kuyrukta, kuyrukta. network ederekten. <gülüyor> böyle, böyle başka birisiyle Türkçe konuşuyorum. Birisi sıradan geri döndü. Siz Türk müsünüz diye başladı ve biz 3 senedir çok yakın dost olduk. Takışmanın kurucusu Birkaç kelime söylemek istiyor musun Turkish Winata? Çok söyleyeceğim zaten. Peki, sahne senin. <gülüyor> ee, tabii bu arada başlamadan önce 6 dakikam. Ee, Ali Bey de Turkish Win'in en büyük destekçisi ve İltek ekibinle kendisine tekrar teşekkür ediyoruz. Eğer burada Turkish Winner'larımız varsa bir ayağa kalkıp bir alkışlayabilir misiniz Ali Bey'i? Ali Bey çok güzel başka sosyal sorumluluk projelerine de destek veriyor. Buradan hemen bir şey yapıyorum. Turkish Bin'in dili İngilizce, o yüzden sunumum İngilizce ve başlıyorum. I have been fascinated with networks. Networking, what makes people connect? Why do you make these connections? And I will tell you why. After I graduated from the Austrian High School in Istanbul, I went to Worcester, Massachusetts to study, and then after two years in Worcester, which is a town that you don't want to know about, I went to London, and after two years in London, I went to New York. So I'm in my 20s. This is about 20 years ago, and there is no internet that we use like today. You cannot search, you cannot find people. I don't have a cell phone. English is my second foreign language. I went to the Austrian high school, so I have a communication problem. And I'm in a place where I don't know anyone. I have to connect to people, to build a social life, then to build up my career. So I had to take networking very seriously. The search began. First, like every Turk living abroad, I tried to find Turkish people. Then as I had different experiences, I reached out to different circles. I worked in finance, I tried to find women, I got to alumni networks, and then finally, like most of you, I found TED. Whether I was uh, actually watching a TED talk online at home or attending the conference in California or organizing a TEDx event in New York, I was finally surrounded with people who were similar to me. Like-minded, they were on action to a place and they really wanted to help me even without getting to know me. They knew they could see the fire and we were connected. So as the fascination with TED took place, I also realized the ideas that spread were the simplest and the, the stories that spread were the most personal. So you connect to someone and as I was connecting to these speakers, I was thinking, you know, if she can do it, so can I. If he can do it, so can I. These people that we listen to most of the time have overcome so much more than what I want to go, what I want to do. Uh, but what is it that's holding me back? What is it that's holding you back? So perhaps the inspiration is just part of it. You need a network to cheer you on, to, to catch you when you're falling, to help you make connections, and to inspire you, empower you, and to cheer with you. So the idea then formed. I wanted to create a network that I wish I had when I left Istanbul. It's a place where people with similar values connect. It's a place that has a lot of storytelling, so our ideas and our messages are going to be traveling much further. And uh, I wanted to make it more personal for women like me who have a connection to Turkey. And if you create the network effect as a result, you find inspiration, empowerment, connections, and you are never alone. So uh, with this journey, Turkish Win was born. In 2009, the idea came to the full circle. In 2010, in November, we launched Turkish Win in New York. And Turkish Win today is a global network for women with cultural, professional and family ties to Turkey. We help each other with around four programs. We have the talks that are also posted online. Then we have a mentoring program. 
We have a networking program, and we have a campus program for students that we invest in in their second and third year at university. So this network now is across four continents with its membership, and um, it's, we have uh, activities in three cities, Istanbul, Boston, and New York, and by the end of the year, we will be you know, across the globe in many other places. Men and women invest in Turkish Win. Ali invests in Turkish Win, others invest in Turkish Win with their ideas, with their resources, and uh, with their connections. And what brings us as the common denominator is the values that we share, curiosity, courage, transparency, and generosity. And women started giving their stories. We have had these talks, and these three minutes, six minutes, 20 minute talks are posted online, and we realize the stories that inspired us the most are the stories that come from ordinary women with extraordinary courage to do something different. So we feel like if she can do it, so can I. I want to introduce you to three women very shortly and, and to their stories. Sedef left her cushy job at Goldman Sachs in New York to pursue her dream to compete in the Olympics in windsurfing category. She was in her 30s. So she quit the job not knowing where it's going to go. For a year or so, she trained. And then uh, she made it to Olympics to, in China. Duga has been blind since she is two. She works at Microsoft. She's 25, a recent university graduate. And in her spare time, she invests in the blind children to become leaders with Yanguri Academy. And Nadine was really provoked with the OWL project of 1453. And she uh, made a difference by taking action to protect the Fafi forest with 10 Turkish liras and a Facebook account. If they can do it, so can we. To watch the full talks online, uh, you can go to turkishwind.com. In closing, I encourage, especially the young people in the audience and online, to invest in your network. Invest in your network. Uh, if you are there and know only your neighbors, your family, uh, your uh, friends at school, you just need to get out of your comfort zone to be inspired, to be connected, uh, and to move on. May inspiration, networking, and connections be with you all the time. Thank you. Thank you.